Welcome back to Chaos Collectibles. All right, so this is what I've been waiting to receive by UPS. This is the Scar Hulk, War Hulk on Throne by Queen Studios. This is a quarter scale statue. And it is a freaking behemoth. I missed UPS yesterday. They were supposed to be here between 12.30 and 4.30. I was trying to get out of work early. And I got a notification at 10.30 that this thing was supposed to be dropped off. But lucky for me, as I was doing some paperwork before going to job number two, the guy came back at about 4 o'clock said his boss told him to get this thing off the truck because it is one massive piece. The original box was huge. However, the statue is so heavy that people have complained, even the person that sold it to me, that the art box as well as the shipper we're completely destroyed by this thing. The styrofoam boxes and the straps were fine, so this guy had to make shift two boxes. He put it in two boxes. One box was 17 pounds. The other box was 115 pounds. I couldn't even get the box downstairs. I had to pull this thing out, carry the base, which is the Hulk's body, as well as the base downstairs, all the weapons, the head, and the back of the throne are all separate parts that plug into this thing. This thing weighs over 130 pounds. It is freaking massive. This is my Skeletor life-size bust. This is my quarter scale Hulk. This Hulk is heavier than the bust that I just showed you of Skeletor. Let's take a look at this bad boy. Let's take a look at it. So first, let's go into this grimacing face of the Hulk. He looks mad as hell. In fact, this does have some switch out heads, but only the premium Edition has it. There was 500 of these made, 300 of the premium. I do not have the premium. However, the premium did come with little stands to put the heads on it. So the head does come off, but they did an excellent job of hiding that seam with the necklaces. You can barely see it. But look at, look at the face on this guy. The eyes, the skin texture, the hair, the musculature. Look at the size of this handle of this axe compared to my hand. That is like a real sized axe right there. Crazy weapons. Look at the fingers, the fingernails, the texture of the leather, the toenails on this guy, even kind of shiny. But yeah, look at these freaking weapons. The leather detail, leather work. Sitting on a rocky throne on top of a red cape. I don't know if that's Thor's cape, whose cape it is, but sword. Shield. Another axe, a spiked mace. The texture of the cape material. This thing is a phenomenal piece. This just may be my favorite statue right there's the helmet. One of the, the uh, heads, switch out heads, is a version with that helmet on it. But this is a, a freaking monster of a piece right here. 
I exercised three to four days a week, pretty hard, lifting heavy weights, and this thing was still tough for me to carry down here by myself. It's like carrying them strongman stones, you know? This thing barely fits through the doorway. In fact, it is 27 inches tall. The depth of the shelf is 24 inches. As you can see, that's about the depth of this thing. The width of this has got to be 30 plus inches because this shelf is four feet wide. It's really hard to put it in perspective until you actually see this thing. I saw a video where a guy had this sitting next to the juggernaut and it just must have been the angle of the quarter scale juggernaut. Because in that video, the juggernaut looked quite a bit bigger, but no, this Hulk is huge. If this Hulk were standing, he'd probably be damn near 28, 30 inches tall. So very huge quarter scale Hulk. This thing is the size of, if not bigger than my third scale statues besides my Sagat, which is almost half scale because it's so damn big. Very massive piece. Excited to have this in my collection. And uh, I think the guy really lost his ass on it because when he shipped the two boxes, not kidding, this guy spent almost $600 in shipping to get this from California to me. Um, I don't know if it was because he got insurance on it or what, but it was very expensive. I didn't pay not even a third of that to get it shipped when I bought this on eBay from him. Got a killer deal on it because these sell for, I don't know, on eBay, about three grand. And I only paid a fraction of that for it. Very massive piece. Very awesome. Although it is the most expensive statue I have purchased, it was definitely worth it. Very, very awesome. In fact, this is where my TV used to be. I removed my TV, PlayStation, got that stuff out of here. Never really watched it anyways. And wanted to put this bad boy down here instead. But yeah, there you have it, folks. The quarter scale Warhawk on throne by Queen Studios. Thanks again for tuning in, everybody. Hope you all have an awesome day. Until next time. Woo!